Welcome back to another interview with a company participating in the Access Control Village at Cree Tech, New York, which is happening September 19th and 20th at the Javits Center. Um, as we've said before, we're excited to have 15 companies come together to really put together a story, uh, show you use cases. And specifically here, I've got the team from HID with me who is participating in something that we're calling the Day in the Life, which is a handful of companies came together to actually show the integration of the experience that can be done uh, with, with mobile, uh, but also with all these companies working interoperable together, which has been when we did the study through SIA, the Security Industry Association's Prop Tech Advisory Board with Cretech. One of the biggest complaints that the the real estate industry had was the interoperability side. So happy to be showcasing that. But without further ado, Troy, I want to thank you very much for taking the time today to introduce yourself, HID, and talk a little bit about what we can expect at Cree Tech. Fantastic. Thanks, Lee. Happy to be here. Sure. My name is uh, Troy Johnston, uh, working for HID Global. I look after the strategic alliances business across Americas and spend most of my days working with what we call our technology partners on their integration projects, both at an API and SDK level, and helping them implement uh, their final solutions. And there's such a big focus on, on the commercial real estate space, I guess is what we're talking about today. Very cool. So if you could um, speak a little bit about your views of sort of the, the added value that mobile has um, as we move from you know keys to cards, so now including mobile. Yeah, I mean, there's lots of values. I mean, there's uh, the sustainability angle. I mean, plastic is not great. I mean, that that's uh, well known, but it's mainly the interoperability and the ability to use the same, I guess, form factor, e.g. a handset and jump from a base building to a tenancy, utilize that across touch points. And more and more, we see the need for people wanting to jump across different assets, as an example. So it's that flexibility. Um, it's the mass onboarding, you know, from a CRE perspective, they can mass onboard a tenancy within minutes. Um, they can offboard people just as efficiently. But I think the key takeaway is that tenant has that wonderful experience with a single touch point, no matter where they go into an asset. And that's, I guess, that in, in, in a nutshell, those abilities or the ability to have that flexibility is critical. Yeah, I love it. It's going from, you know, an industry that kept bad people out as the create the value creation to now, in addition to that, it's about operational efficiency. It's about great user experience and it's adding value. And then it opens up this whole opportunity also for revenue generation that probably didn't exist before. So a lot of exciting stuff happening. You'll get to learn more about this when you stop by the Access Control Village at Cree Tech. We've got not only the 15 companies that are going to be there, but in the center of the space that we have is a stage where we'll be doing thought leadership and use case presentations every 10 and 20 minutes. So a ton of activation over the two days. Come see what Troy's talking about, the experience that's there. Come meet all the companies and look forward to seeing you uh, in New York in a couple of weeks. Thank you, Troy. Thanks, Lee.